to the vlog. It is the 17th of April 2019. It is the end of day one. Uh, this is the second attempt at recording this because, full disclaimer, I tend to start rambling and go off on tangents wildly. So if that starts happening again, there might just be a straight cut and go into something else. Um, so, end of day one, and eating nothing but potatoes all day has actually been nowhere near as bad as I thought it would be. It's not been easy by any stretch of the imagination. Um, when I was getting my son's lunch ready, for example, and later on his, you know, his dinner, his evening meal, um, the little voice in the back of my head, you know, the, the, the one that says, go over to the edge, look over, now jump. You know, that, that little annoying thing, the intrusive thoughts, the, uh, I think it's called the pathos, I want to say. I'm not sure, I might have to Google that later. Um, that voice was just going, go on, man. It's just a, just a tiny, tiny little piece of bread. Just, you know, like, it's a little bit of chia batter, though. If you like chia batter, eat the chia batter. Oh, you know, like it's only a tiny little bit of chocolate, it's a little bit of little bit of tasty sauce from uh, from the meat that you've been preparing. Like, come on, man, just just do it. Nah, yeah, okay. <laughs> I've I've stuck completely. Uh, potato total, <laughs> potato total, and uh, and water. Forgive the branding. Uh, I'm fairly certain you can't see it, but you know if you can make out a goblin with an axe. You may know what it is, I don't know. But anyway, um, last night, went to bed after after midnight, uh, had a potato for supper, uh, because I basically I was up pretty late, just making sure that this was all uploaded to YouTube and, and had been tweeted out and sent to specific people on my Facebook that I actually wanted to let know about this. Um, mainly, <laughs> mainly, Vegans and vegetarians I know that I have, you know, sort of said like, oh, I, I don't think I could ever do that. I think they would, I think they're actually going to get a kick out of seeing fat boy <laughs> give up meat for any amount of time. And, uh, and you know, alcohol and stuff like that as well. Um, that's going to be fun. But I woke up this morning. After uh, after a decent enough sleep, I guess like a little bit a little bit earlier than I would have liked, but that's just part and parcel of being a parent. Um, had three potatoes for my breakfast, which were really tasty, even cold. Um, which again was surprised by. I, I I think I've heard that I'm meant to cook them, uh, bake them, let them cool completely. Excuse me. Potato diet. Yay. Uh, and then microwave them or, or heat them up in the oven again. I'm, I'm, I'm not entirely sure on that. So to save possibly doing it wrong, I'm just going to eat them cold or when they've just come out of the oven. I, I, it's something to do with the uh, resistant starches that are formed, I believe. So uh, we'll, we'll see. For, for now, it's just potatoes. I'm fairly confident in my ability to stick with potatoes, regardless of what I do with them. Yeah, it's so all day. Done pretty good. And I feel good about going into tomorrow and eating even more potatoes. Uh, the ones that I'm working with currently are really weird. I don't know what the so I, I know there's different types of potatoes i know there's like king edwards and jersey royals and, and countless others and this that and the other and if we were in britain i'd be perfectly fine going out and saying right i want that potato that potato that potato there we go that's four or five different breeds of potato all good over here in germany not so much so uh, i'm I've managed all of today on uh, Speisekartoffel, 
Uh, and tomorrow I have a mix of Speisekartoffeln and Spargelkartoffeln. So uh, I don't necessarily know what Speisekartoffeln is. I think it's just normal cooking potatoes. Um, but Spargel is the German word for asparagus. So essentially asparagus potatoes. Now I don't know whether that means that they're a crossbreed or whether or not it's like just meant to be eaten with asparagus because Germans go crazy for white asparagus this time of year um, just as it's started coming out and, and ready to ready to eat so yeah that's going to be an interesting an interesting little experiment an interesting discovery as of exactly what that tastes like um, that's all all my batch is cooked up um, i've eaten a total of 11 potatoes since midnight on the 16th going into the 17th uh, so I've I've got one left over out of the initial batch. I might eat that before bed. I'm not entirely sure. I'm I'm pretty okay for the minute. I'm I'm potatoed out. But I've got another twelve there for tomorrow, and there's a few that are a little bit bigger in that as well. So I might end up going into into day three with a couple left over. Not too bad, I suppose. Um, yeah. All in all, feeling pretty good, feeling pretty confident. Tomorrow's gonna to be a bit of a, a, an interesting test. I was gonna save day one up until tomorrow. I've been planning all of this for a couple of weeks. Um, not necessarily the vlogging part, but definitely the dieting part. And what I had planned was, because quite a lot of people say that day three and day four are the big, painful ones like the ones where you feel hungry but you know you're gonna try eating a potato and it's gonna make you gag and not feel happy and then after that you have day five where you feel a lot better all of a sudden um because of that i was planning to do day three and day four on saturday and sunday this week but i was reminded that friday is good friday so my day three is now Good Friday when my wife isn't at work and, you know, my day four is the Saturday. So hopefully everything works out okay and I'm not just a giant lump of grumpiness. We'll see. I guess. Um, but yeah, tomorrow is going to be a bit of a trial. Um, it was originally meant to be day one tomorrow. Uh, and that we that the reason for that is on Thursdays I go to a uh, English speaking board games evening a Brettspielabend uh, with a bunch of friends from America and Slovenia and Germany and countless places across the world all of whom live in Berlin and speak English which means that we can all get together, we can all play a board game, uh, or three, as the case usually yeah, usually is, and, you know, sort of enjoy our nerdy pursuits together. Which is, you know, it's how I, how I spend my time. It's my little de-stress for the week. So there they have vegetarian stews and potato dishes, uh, using salt and oil and things like that. Um, they have beer that's very cheap. They have biscuits and cookies that are all very, very cheap as well. And everything's laid out for you and ready to go. And I was gonna save my day one for that. But I actually think day two, if I go into it and I take my water, take a couple of potatoes, I, I should, be, should be good actually. Like, I, I've managed to resist temptation today while there's no witnesses, so resisting temptation in front of the 30 to 40 to 50 witnesses that usually turn up should be a little bit easier, I hope. And most of them know that I'm going to be bringing my own food tonight, or tomorrow night, I should say. So it should be okay. I think. I hope. Um, yeah, what else is there? Oh, um, weights and things. What I will probably do is at the end of each week, I will 
put a little notification up somewhere on here. Uh, a little uh, a little title card or something that just says what my current weight is and what my starting weight was uh, in both kilograms and pounds because why not? Um, it's probably a little bit easier and clearer than doing it day by day because obviously day by day you can have weight fluctuations, it depends on whether or not you've had water, how soon after your shower it is or all sorts of countless different little bits and bobs that can change everything. So once a week, that sounds that sounds about right. If it gets to the end of this first week and I haven't lost anything, I'm going to be really upset. But I imagine that I'm going to, uh, I think, ready for tomorrow. I'm going to get rid of all of this as well. I, 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 you know, I've let it get out of hand again, um, <laughs> just because I can't go out to that many social functions. No one really cares whether or not I'm, you know, rocking my rocking my terrible hair and beard. But, you know, turn over a new leaf. Bit of better self-care, that sort of thing. So yeah, I think uh, I think tomorrow I'll, I'll get rid of all of this. I'll maybe do a, a walking vlog on the way to the uh, to the board games evening and let you know how things have gone. If only because it might very well be after midnight when I get back. I don't particularly feel like doing a vlog and then, you know, <laughs> going and like doing all of that, getting home at one in the morning and then doing a vlog. Like that would be not great, pretty much. But anyway, well, fingers crossed. Sounds a little bit better on this one as well. Um, and yeah, I guess I will see all of you tomorrow. Yeah. Stay awesome. Bye-bye.